Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Marvin again back with some more music reactions. Welcome back to Smitty Reacts. And on this video, we're going to be checking out some music some from Kakra Khan. Now, the name of this song is Anyone, and it's a cover of a Demi Lovato song. Um, I'll say this. Um, I'm really not familiar with Demi Lovato. I, I'm really not. I know she's a pop singer. Uh, I know she's been out doing her thing for a while, but I've actually cannot name a song from her. <laughs> so I'm um, definitely kind of interested to check this song out to kind of, kind of get a feel of the song and by proxy a, a feel of what Demi Lovato does. But I'm definitely here for Kakra Khan. I've, I've heard two of his songs so far up to the up to date, um, just hearing his vocals and stuff. And he's an amazing singer. Dude can go so far. So I'm definitely here to check this one out. So of course, before I hit start, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Smitty underscore reacts on Instagram. Find me over there. And let's go ahead and jump into this one. Let's get it. Okay. Try to talk to my piano. I try to talk to my guitar. Okay, buddy. Talk to my imagination. Confide it into alcohol. I try to try to try some more. Like secret still, my voice was sore. Tired of empty conversation. Cause no one hears me anymore. A hundred million stories and a hundred million songs. I feel stupid when I sing. Nobody's listening to me. Nobody's listening. Talk to shooting stars, but they always get it wrong. I feel stupid when I pray. Why am I praying anyway? Mm. If nobody's listening. Pause right here for a moment. Off the top, I'm digging the lyrics of the song. Oh my goodness. Like the storytelling in there, like the kind of introspective nature of the song and the lyrics like are awesome. You know, like to me, lyrics like that come from a place of genuine frustration. Um, for lack of better terms, even being alienated. And a disconnect from society as a whole. Like, you're disconnected from people around you. You're disconnected from things that are supposed to help you out. Like, she said, like, well, I'm assuming that she wrote the song. But in the lyrics, anyway, it says, like, um, you know, what am I praying for anyway? You know, like, what if nobody's even there listening to me? Like, what, I'm wasting my time. This is useless. You know, like, just in the little bit of lyrics I'm picking up here. Now, the way that he's conveying this song is amazing because it's really heartfelt. You can tell it's very emotional, you know, and coming from a genuine place as well. So, like, shout out to shout out to him for um, being able to portray that emotion off the gate here. I'm only like a minute into the song, so I'm going to rewind it a little bit. <laughs> but that was really good. Like, this dude's just, his voice just grabs you. It really does. It really takes you in. Like it. Let's go. Listening to me. Nobody's listening. Nobody's listening, huh? Talk to shooting stars, but they always get it wrong. I feel stupid when I pray. Why am I praying anyway? If nobody's listening, hmm. anyone, please send me anyone. Lord, is there anyone? I need someone. song right here is a cry for help send me it really is Lord, is there anyone? Mm. Too many times, I just need some more affection, anything to get me by. A hundred million stories and a hundred million songs. I feel stupid when I sing. 
That's a thousand percent right. I like I like the poetic nature of the song as well because it's just like, look, like, why am I doing all these things that are that are literally useless? Why am I why am I like literally crying out for help and nobody's listening? Nobody's taking me seriously. Nobody's validating my needs or my concerns. No one around me is taking me seriously. You know, and when you feel that way, like really, really feel that way, it's very easy to just retreat into yourself like mental health is real y'all like i suffered from it last year um just going through different things it's all it's documented on my channel a while back but it's like you know when you get into your head that uh, that you know really deep into your head it's very hard to get yourself out of that and that can lead down its own path of destruction it could lead you to like she says in the song drinking and maybe drugs or other things to try to self-medicate to feel better about things when honestly like and I don't want to say this like frivolously, but sometimes you just need to address the issue, the underlying cause of whatever it is that's ailing you and attack the, the source, you know, as opposed to trying to medicate and just take out the symptoms, you know, like the, the, the pain and the hurt and everything. But sometimes you have to address those things to be able to move forward. But I like the fact that she's able to like articulate that into a song uh, a lot better than I am, <laughs> you know, but it's really cool. But I keep saying her because I'm thinking about maybe a, a female singing, a female singing this song or a woman's voice, voice hearing this song, even though I'm listening to him sing the song, but I'm just kind of like trying to like connect those dots together, um, you know, mentally make it happen up, up in here. But at the same time, I appreciate the song just as it is. It doesn't matter who's singing it. This is a, this is a universal song. I might have to go learn this song. <laughs> I might have to go break it out of karaoke the next time I go out, you know, just to kind of see what people's uh, reactions are to it. Just to see, you know what I'm saying, a, a, a retired karaoke host get up and try to tackle this this song from Demi Lovato. That'd be kind of cool to see. I don't know if I could pull it off, but I'd try it. <laughs> anyway, let me rewind back a little bit and get back to it, man. But this is like a heavy song right here. Some, you know what I'm saying, some real life stuff going on. Like, let's get it. I took to shooting stars, but they always get it wrong. Right. I feel stupid when Tried I pray. astrology, that didn't Why work. Why the fuck am I praying anyway? If Try religion, that didn't work. Mm. Mm. Anyone, I cry for help. Send me anyone. Lord, is there anyone? I need someone. Man, his voice is so good. Oh my goodness. That song I have you, you know, feelings. Man. Man. Give it up. Give it up for Kakra Khan right here, man. He he grabbed that song by the neck and he held on to it. You know? He really did his thing on that track. And I, I definitely appreciate the his interpretation of it and the way he was able to emote his way through that song. Really great, really powerful lyrics. You know, really great song. And I love the fact that it's a stripped down song. It's just the piano, you know, just an acoustic kind of set. set. And it's just him and the piano and, and, and pouring your hat out into the microphone. Like, nothing gets more, you know, eloquent than that this, at some times. Just a stripped down song with a good message, you know, and really just trying to story tell. And, and yeah, that song is great. Now I have to go listen to the Demi Lovato version. <laughs> you know, I'm, I have to get more familiar with her. Um, I do remember seeing her in the headlines years, 
mid was it last year or maybe earlier this year where she was having some struggles with drugs and um, I think she may be overdosed maybe if I'm thinking right um you know and that's tough that's that's a tough thing to go through like I've had friends that's that that's happened to and um they struggle with that like I had a friend that literally passed away from an overdose but then came back <laughs> you know but died on the died in the emergency room or the hospital for like a few minutes at least four or five minutes they didn't think they were going to pull through but they did thank god but you know at the same time it's like that can happen and then after that you have to deal with the ramifications of that your mental faculties may never be the same because sometimes you may have brain damage you may have traumas and, and such from things you have to overcome and that's a whole nother thing you have to worry about which can lead to more depression which can lead you down that path again it's a, it's a cyclical thing sometimes and it's it's something you don't want to be into so if you need help reach out to somebody you know like reach out to help professionals reach out to trusted friends and allies and support groups there's ways to kind of get into your own headspace safely with the help of somebody else to help you unpack your baggage and literally like hang it up in the closet and put it away <laughs> like that's the only way i can describe it you you carry on that baggage and the luggage for so long you might even forget that it's there until one day you unpack it and then all of a sudden it's in your face and you're like oh my gosh i have all this stuff to deal with but take it a piece at a time and once you take that piece Put it in the closet, put it on the rack, and then hopefully at some point you'll be able to close that closet door and not worry about it. You know what I'm saying? It'll go, it's never getting rid of trauma, but it's learning to deal with trauma. It's learning to deal with those kind of emotions and feelings that you really need to do in order to be able to move forward with your life. And that's on different scaling, of course, depending on the amount of trauma and blah, blah, blah. I'm not trying to dive into it that deep right now, anyway. Yes, I am. I ain't gonna say that. I am. <laughs> but if you need help with it, reach out to somebody for real. Anyway, I'm gonna get off my little sandbox, my little soapbox over here. Uh, long story short, I definitely appreciate that song. I definitely appre appreciate Cockra Khan for, for making that thing come to life. And if you guys want me to check out the Demi Lovato video um, version of this song, let me know if she has an official video, things like that. Put them in my links, drop it in the comments. Um, hit me up on Instagram with it, Smitty underscore reacts. Yeah, I got to get the plug. <laughs> and, uh, you know, let me know. So at any rate, y'all, I'm going to get out of this video. Thanks for watching along with me. Hope, I hope I'm a little tirade didn't go too long for you. But if anyway, if you're at the end of this video, you're a real one. And I hope you have a great day for real. So at any rate, I'm going to get out of here. So until the next video, take care of yourself. Be kind to one another. If y'all can do all that, I'll see you guys in the next video. All right? All right. Peace.